Hi there, my name is Nancy Hoppy with Raising Dreamers Ministries. This week we've taken a quick look at what is Advent in hopes that maybe you will be able to celebrate Advent with your own family and friends. But Advent is a season where we celebrate the anticipation of the coming of Jesus. And we look at the themes of the candles that are lit in the Advent wreath, which are of hope, peace, joy, and love. And then the fifth center largest candle is that that represents Jesus himself. So we have reason to celebrate because we have the hope of um, his coming. We have the peace that he has given us because he has come. We have the joy that he has offered us because his joy is in us because he came. And then the love, which is the love he demonstrated with, through the sacrifice of him coming down to earth for ourselves and our sin to um, reestablish ourselves. Okay, five reasons why we celebrate Advent. One, Advent is not about us, it's about him. And that's actually a good thing. In this world, there's so much that is always about us, me, 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 and it's so much to think about. But for us to put our perspective on the Lord and think about him, that is a reason to celebrate, and I hope that you'll be able to do that successfully this season. Number two, Advent connects us to a great history. We're not the first people. It's nice to know that there have been many Christians from the first century that have been able to spend time anticipating and looking forward to his coming and now looking forward to his coming again. So we're a part of a larger line of other great Christians who've gone before us, and that should comfort us. Third, Advent cultivates patience amidst a frantic season. When we can take the time to slow down and think about how we all are waiting for his coming, and it gives us the patience that's so necessary in a very busy time. It's a great reason to celebrate Advent. Number four, Advent engenders the rare jewel of Christmas contentment. And we want to be able to recognize that the true gifts are Jesus himself and not in all of the things that we get caught up with that we might feel discontent about. Lastly, Advent brings joyful confidence in the promises of God. We've seen his promises fulfilled and we know and we are confident that he will continue to fulfill the promises that he says for us in scripture. It enables Christian fellowship and mutual encouragement, and it helps us to be able to maintain Hebrews 10, 25, let us not neglect meeting together as some have made a habit, but let us encourage one another and all the more as you see the day approaching. So yes, Christmas is coming, but even more Jesus is coming at some point, and may we patiently be ready, but may we actively be anticipating his coming. I hope that you were able to take something out of this week and that you're able to then apply it into your own lives. Happy Advent season!